welcome back to Treasures by Tina. I'm so happy that you guys are joining me today. So hello for all of you who are subscribed and hello to everybody who's joining us today. Please make sure you don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the little notifications button. I try to do videos at least once or twice a week and I'm working on kind of doing maybe three a week. It depends on how my schedule goes, but definitely I do Thrift With Me Thursdays and this is part of Thrift With Me Thursday episode six, but I wanted to find all kinds of things that I could redo my hutch with. And I wanted to find them all at Goodwills or thrift stores. So with that being said, I'm gonna jump right in and I'm gonna show you guys what I got and grab yourself a drink. <clears throat> Excuse me, I have my water and I'm gonna show you what I got. So first thing I got was at Goodwill in Clinton, Connecticut, which is like a shoreline town. So I found this really beautiful kind of flat basket. This is not for the hutch. This is going to be for my dining room table, but for $2.99, I couldn't pass it up. You know how it is. You go into Goodwill and you look for one or two things and you have like, you know, you're focused and then who knows what you're going to find in there and you can't let it go because you can't go back again because it won't be there. So I got this basket and I'm gonna use this on my dining table, which I will show you guys at some point when I do my home tour, probably in like two weeks. So I got that, <coughs> excuse me, that's why I have my water. So I also found this beautiful basket, which almost looks like, kind of like a firewood basket kind of thing. Um, but this was on sale for, it was regularly, hold on, let me see. It was $3.99 and it was half off. So it was like, what, $2.75, $2.50, something like that. So I grabbed this and I'm gonna use this, also not for the hutch, believe it or not, but um, I'm going to use this in our bedroom for like spare um, throws that we have. So I'll just roll them up and I'll put them all in here. And I thought this basket was just so beautiful that I had to grab it. So now we will go on to actual hutch items. <laughs> You know how it is, like I said, goodwill is goodwill. <laughs> you know, you run in there and you grab some stuff. So the first thing I got, and this one um, was from the Clinton Goodwill, and it is a Kakakuna club, and it's a crock. <coughs> and it was only 99 cents, and it's missing the top. But I grabbed it anyway, because I just love little crocks like this. And I figured I'll stick a little plant in there or some florals in there. I'll stick it on some plates. But even though it's missing the top, which is very sad, but I had to have it, so I grabbed it anyway. And then, funny story, so the employee, you know how they grab their um, rolling carts and they put everything on there and then they go through the store? Well, he brushed by me <laughs> with a cart full of stuff to put away on the shelves and I found another crock and I grabbed it right out of there as he was walking by. I just scooped in and I grabbed it out, but I had to have it. And it was only $2.99? Yes, $2.99. And it's a beautiful on the top. Whoops, did you see that go flying? But it all works, it all hooks up together. And I grabbed it. So this was like a great purchase. And like I said, if I had walked out of the store without following the guy putting stuff away, I wouldn't have been able to get it. So I was so happy that I was able to get it. So I got it. I got that. And then I got these two really pretty, they're kind of scalloped bowls. I don't know what the name is on them. It's kind of smudged a little bit. Um, but I got two little bowls and they kind of reminded me of like tulips or something like that. They're very, very springy and summery. So they only had two, so I grabbed them both and they were, they were 99 cents each. So I grabbed those. And I also grabbed, <laughs> and this one was $4.99, but it was like a casserole dish with a top and it's taped up. So obviously I have to wash it and take the tape off. Um, but I think it's stoneware, but it's really, really super heavy. And I just loved it. It has like a little braided top. Oh, there's my cat. That's Wednesday. Um, it has like a little braided top on it. And I thought this would look so pretty in the hutch too. So I grabbed that. And then I think that's all of the items I got from 
No, it's not because I got two clothes items as well. <clears throat> so for clothes, as you know, like I said, you can't just go there and not get anything for yourself other than what you're looking for. So I just got a New York, um, I think it's Old Navy. Yeah, it's Old Navy. Just this plain t-shirt and it was like $2. So I grabbed it. Can never have too many t-shirts. And then I got this really pretty gray gap sweater. And this was this was half off. So it was $8.99. So I got it for what, like $4.50? Um, which is kind of a longer cardigan. And it's super lightweight. So I figured I could even wear it with a t-shirt underneath and like shorts and wedges or white sneaks. Um, so I grabbed that as well. So that was everything that I got from the Clinton Goodwill. Now moving on to the Goodwill that's by my house or by my work rather, because I go there at lunchtime sometimes. So I got a few things from Goodwill. So this was the first thing I got and I can't really see who makes it, but it's a really pretty basket and it has leather handles. And I thought this would look so pretty in the hutch, maybe with some greenery in it or a plant. I'm not really sure yet where it's gonna go or how it's gonna go, but I'm definitely gonna use this. I just absolutely love, the, I love the leather handles. So I got that. And then just on a whim, I just got some wood and they were a dollar each. Just some wooden um, like cooking spoons, spaghetti strainer, whatever you wanna call it. So I just grabbed those real quick. <laughs> and then I got another basket and this one also has leather handles on it and it was $4. So maybe I'll use the baskets like at the very top of the hutch, kind of do a vignette up there, something like that. I'm not really sure yet, um, but I got that too. You know, there's so many things that you can do with baskets. You could stick a plant in it. You could stick plates in them kind of sideways. You can roll up napkins or pretty towels. I mean, the possibilities are endless. And even if you use a basket like in your hutch or on your dining table or somewhere like that, you can always take it out and use it somewhere else. I move stuff through this house like you would not believe. And it's funny because my cousin, my husband will come home and he'll be like, where did that, that's not supposed to be there. And I'm like, why well, I moved it around. And so he never knows what's going on. He comes home every day and you know, Lord only knows where stuff is, but anyway. Then the next thing I got were, I thought I loved these. These were crate and barrel um, bowls and they were $4 each. And they're just kind of like a funky shape. And they had two of them, so I grabbed them both. And you know, a crate and barrel, these are super expensive. So I was really happy to find two at Goodwill for $4 each. So I got those. Then I got... I also found these pretty, um, and these were $2 each. These are fault scrap, <clears throat> um, but also two plates. And they have like a scalloped edge on them, which I really love. So I'm gonna do something with this and those bowls, or maybe these bowls, I'm not sure yet. I'm really gonna play around with the hutch and try to figure it out. I have lots of options now to use in the decor, so that's great. <clears throat> Excuse me, and then I also got for two dollars this little gravy boat. But I thought it was so pretty, made in China. Um, and I, I just grabbed that up. It's like super plain, but I figured I'd put a little plant in it, or maybe a napkin folded over, or something draping. Not sure yet, but I grabbed that. And then I also grabbed <clears throat> and these are from. Manor Lane, but these are three bowls and these were $2 each. So I grabbed three of them. So either I'll stack all three together or I might put them next to each other. I'm not really sure what I'm gonna do yet, but I'm really excited um, for all these finds. So this was, I think that was it. Yep. So that was everything that I got um, from Two Goodwills. And these are the items that I'm going to use to style my hutch. So I'm gonna show you guys what the hutch looks like now, and then I'm gonna go ahead and start moving things around. So let's go take a look. Okay guys, so this is what the hutch looks like now. And as you can see, I used a lot of 
my collection of old teapots um, with the little feet on them. I use those, I use candlesticks, I had some trays, and I think it's beautiful, I really do, but I also think it's very um, winterish. I don't think it really brings us into summer and spring very well. And then up there, I just have some greenery, which I'll probably use. And then I have another um, pot that I made actually and has greenery in it and just some glass bottles and some antlers. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to empty it all out and wipe it all down because it's always best to start with a clean surface when you're going to do this. And these are the items that I laid out on my dining room table that I'm going to be using in the hutch. And I have a lot of whites. I have some full florals. I just moved my teapots to the side because I'm not sure what I'm going to do with them just yet. Um, I have the two crocs I had and everything is wiped down and it's all clean so it is ready for me to start to decorate. So the first thing I did was put some greenery in the bigger basket that I got and I put it right at the top and I thought it was good just to kind of anchor the space and then I put another greenery in the other smaller basket with a book under it just so that I could have baskets on each side because I really wanted them up there. So those are the two crate and barrel um, plates I had and then the daisies I got from Dollar General and I put them in the pitcher. Now I'm going to go ahead and add the old crock and I just love the way that looks with the old with the new. Um, I just think it just brings out something with the white and the browns. Now I have the flower plates in. I have another vase um, with some baby's breath in it and I actually carry that um, for my wedding and it's dried out and I just saved it forever. And now we're going to add the little crock that I have with some old tulips that I got from Amazon. And I think I'm just going to leave that right there for right now. And you do have to play around with things sometimes. And I added the little candlesticks but I think I'm going to take one of them out because I don't think that's really the look I was going for. So I added some old books and I think that kind of balances out um, all so much white that I have to put some um, old things in. So that's it. Those are just a few items that I put in. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It's short and sweet. Um, just so you can get kind of an idea of the look I was going for and trying to mix the old with the new. And those were my thrifted items. Um, the only thing I bought were the florals from Dollar General. So you guys have a great day, everybody, and I'll see you the next time. Bye. Thank you.